Let's look at Kepler's laws. The next two laws are about the speeds of the planets. In the second law, it has been said that the area travelled in its orbit by each planet is constant at any given time. Area swept per unit time is constant. We can see it here. As a result of this, when the planet comes closest to the sun, its speed increases. Therefore, even if the average distance from the sun is less, the area there is constant. You must remember. If the planet moves away from the sun, its speed is reduced. Third law, obviously, is about the average distance of the planet from the sun and its revolution time. The square of its period of revolution around the sun is directly proportional to the cube of the mean distance of a planet from the sun. We just saw the animation of these three laws here. Now, Kepler has given these three laws. Kepler was able to note planets moving in elliptical orbits or planets increasing their speeds when they go close to the sun. But he could not explain why all this happens. But Newton could explain this. Newton said that the centripetal force due to which the planets are attracted towards the center and not thrown away is due to the gravity or the gravitational force.